My name is Jen Spencer. I am a recovering meth addict, a former homeless person, and the founder of an organization called the Turtle Shelter Project. We are a kind of like a traveling service where we bring all the materials, all the sewing machines, and we bring the project to you. And we have people help us make foam insulated vests for homeless people. The insulation layer really is what's so brilliant about these, these vests because they're very life-saving. You can get totally soaking wet no matter how cold it is and you won't be cold at all. I started the Turtle Shelter Project because I used to be homeless, living in a storage unit, and the last time that I was homeless was in a really brutal winter. It got so cold that you couldn't even think, and I just was so broken, and it took my will to live. When I discovered this technology, I had been in rehab for about three months, and I went to this emergency preparedness conference, and I learned about this technology and what it could do. And I remember thinking to myself, oh my gosh, immediately thought of how many people's lives could be saved if they just had access to this technology. So then I heard how much it costs, and it was like $780 for a suit and $800 for a sleeping bag, and that just, broke my heart, literally. Only rich people can afford it. They buy it, they take it home and put it on their shelf and they wait for their emergency. And homeless people are in their emergency right now. And that being so fresh in my mind, I just wanted to somehow get this technology into the hands of the people who were the most vulnerable, who needed it the most, but couldn't afford it. Each vest that we make costs $30 for all of the materials. And that is with 100% donated labor. So we make these entirely with volunteers so that not only are we making clothes that are really life-saving for those living out on the streets, but we're also creating opportunities for service. So we've been in business for four years, four and a half years, and to date we have handed out about a thousand in that four-year period. So it's really cool that we've got a goal and we're meeting that goal to get a thousand done this year. We are super excited to partner with America First Credit Union for this project today. We've had over 50 employees show up today to help us and lend their helping hands. We've had lots of different jobs for people to do, sewing and non-sewing stuff. So we've had people pinning and marking and putting things together, matching up components. And then we've had people try their luck at sewing and surging. And we have almost 500 vests that are 90% complete. And we'll just take just a few more steps in order to be able to hand them out this year. So it has been an incredible amount. Ways that people can get involved to help with Turtle Shelter Project, there's a, there's a variety of ways. One of the, the easiest things is just talk about it. Tell people about it. Tell people that the project exists, that the technology exists, and that we bring the project to you and make it easy. Another way that, that people can get involved is we have a Facebook page. We also have an Instagram page. They're both listed under the name Turtle Shelter Project. We also have a website, turtleshelterproject.org. We would love to thank America First Credit Union for this opportunity to come and work side by side with, with your employees. This has been an amazing day and we can't thank you enough. Turtle Shelter Project cannot do what it does without the help of so many willing helping hands. So we just want to thank you so much.